Here's a quick overview of the multi-touch functionality of the application. To zoom in and out, simply use Pinch Zoom. To left click, in the default input mode, tap where you want the click to happen. To right click, tap hold with one finger and quickly tap with the second finger before the first one is lifted. To middle click, do the same thing except tap with two additional fingers. To scroll up and down, swipe up and down with, the, with two fingers. The mouse pointer will appear in the, in the point between the two fingers. There's an additional input mode which I want to show you. To change input modes, you have to find the menu button. If you tap on the screen or you swipe on the screen, you will see that a toolbar appears. On this toolbar, there is a keyboard icon and a menu icon. The toolbar disappears after a timeout. You can also move the toolbar if it's in your way. Here's a menu button. I'm going to switch input modes to simulated touchpad now. In the simulated touchpad mode, when you scroll around on the screen, instead of panning, the mouse pointer is going to move. As you can see, your whole screen has become a touchpad. Clicks and scroll events happen not where you tapped or between your fingers, but where the mouse pointer is. This mode is much more accurate for small screens.